welcome to my channel once again viewers in today's video i'll break down cost of block laying from the foundation to the lentil level i have a lot of people asking me about the cost of building in ghana so i decided to make a video a total uh, cost video alongside so uh, i can share with them and they also have an, an idea of how much it costs in building in Ghana so in today's video I'm going to make a, a breakdown of a, of a block work to the length of. so we're going to start with the materials that we, we use for the project so we start with uh, blocks we use six inches blocks the quantity was uh, 2600 and the cost was nine nine thousand one hundred. That was the cost. And I used forty-two bags of cement, which cost thousand six hundred and eighty Ghana cities. We bought one trip of sand, which cost thousand Ghana cities, and then water, which cost me four hundred Ghana cities. So uh, th this is the mat materials we use for the block work. And uh, in total, it costs 12,180 Ghana cities for the materials. So this is just the, the price for the materials. And then when the work was done, I uh, have to pay for the labor work, which cost me 4,290 Ghana cities. So that was for the labor work. So in total, it cost me... 16,470 analysis. So this is a breakdown of just the block work.
that was for the phase one, which is laying of blocks, the phase two, which is installation of pillars or columns. I would like to mention that I work in phases in short terms. So maybe one phase is a week work, a week or two work. So for the columns or pillar work, we bought 16 mm iron rods, 96 pieces, which cost 4,992 Ghana cities. We bought 10 mm strip, 30 pieces, which cost 600 Ghana cities. We bought binding wires, two rims, which cost 120 Ghana cities. We bought cement for casting 32 pillars or columns. And the, the quantity was 26 bags, which cost 1,040 Ghana cities. And then nails, we bought two box, which cost 120. So in total for the material, we, we spent uh, 6,872 Ghana cities for the materials only. And then the labor work cost 2,360 Ghana cities for the labor work. So in total, we spent 9,232 Ghana cities. So that is just for the pillar work or the columns to hold the blocks in, in place.
So the total cost of laying blocks on top of the foundation till the lentil level costs 25,702 Ghana cities. And I think it's a 13 blocks high and uh, the total space of uh, the total living space of, of my building is uh, 316 meters square. So I hope uh, this gives you uh, an idea of how much it costs to build a house in Ghana. As uh, we proceed with the project, I will do an update step by step. What I'm doing with my uh, contractor is that we work in phases. So I let him know when I'm ready to continue with the project and then he will give me a phase estimate May, maybe for instance with the block work with only block work he will give me an estimate and then I will save up and then uh, when, when I'm ready I let him know and then in a week time or in a week or two the work is done I pay them off and then we go to the next stage and then he gives me an estimate for the next stage but then uh, we make sure that the phase when we are done with one phase we can leave the pro project for some time which will, won't be affected by rain or the climate so this is a little bit tip i would like to give maybe it might also help so it doesn't put much pressure on you so you have time to save money and then go to the next stage but it all depends between you and then your mason or your contractor but i think it is a, a nice idea to work in phases in short terms you know it was in the year 2020 in the month of october